Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today I'm going to be showing you just a little mini Ulta and Sephora haul that I spontaneously went on today. I needed a couple products, but it kind of turned into a mini haul. So I thought I would just come on here and show you what I got. All right, so first I went into Ulta, and um, thankfully I left with a little bag because that would have been a problem if I left with a big one. All right, so the main reason that I went into Ulta was to get some new um, Batiste um, dry shampoo. This is by far my favorite dry shampoo. Um, if you have darker hair, I have red hair, but I hate the red because it's like orange. Um, I use the Divine Dark, and this dry shampoo just sprays out with the dark color, so you don't have like that awkward like kind of gray hair look. Um, this just blends in really nice. It's also great if your roots are growing out and you need to cover them a little bit because you know what I'm saying? Girl, it happens. So Batiste is awesome. This is always a repurchase for me. And today I just got two. So something else that was on my list was to get a brow um, gel pomade because I have used a pencil for like forever, but sometimes, you know, like when it's really dull, it's like perfect and kind of like faded of the line, but then you sharpen it and then you got like intense like sharpie brows and like I feel like it's just really hard to find a happy medium um, with a pencil so I decided I am going to try out the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, dip brow pomade and I got it in Auburn hoping that it will match the MAC um, pencil in um, Redhead because I couldn't find it at Ulta so um, we will see but this is what it looks like um, I, yeah, yeah, you can see it. There you go. I didn't know if it would be covered. Um, but yeah, so I'm really excited to try that out and give it a try. Okay, so next I've been really, really wanting to try the Pureology um, shampoo and conditioner um, for color treated hair. It's sulfate free. It's great. I've been using the L'Oreal um, sulfate free shampoo and conditioner and it's great, but I've always like just heard so much about these and they're so expensive. So I thought instead of buying a $28 bottle of shampoo, I should get the mini sizes first to make sure that I actually like them. So I got the clean volume in both. Super excited to test these out, see how I like them and if I want to go back and make the splurge to get the full size bottles. So I also was in need of some more concealer and I have been using the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer forever, but I have heard just awesome, amazing things about the Tarte Shape Tape and like, let's be real, who doesn't use it by this point? I'm a little bit behind the curve. But, so I went over, I was sneaky, I went over to the MAC section, swiped the color that I use and then figured out my color in the Shape Tape. So that was my little trick if you need to do that. but um. This, I'm so excited to freaking use. I got the shade Light. Um, for the first time in my life, the porcelain color was like 10 times too light, so. I'm feeling good about myself. Okay, so next I've been wanting to try um, faux mink lashes, or even mink, but like I saw that they had all faux mink, and I was like, all right, yeah, let's save the animals. Let's get faux mink. Why not? So I got two pairs of the Eye Lure lashes. Let's see, this one is in Golden Goddess. Just look pretty. Um, really full volume. And then this one is Opulent. Um, both are Eye Lure, um, both are faux mink. Super excited to try these. They were also on sale at Ulta, so get you some lashes. I don't wear lashes often at all. I only wear them when performing, but when I was on the ship, I kind of realized that like, it just really steps up your game if you wear them to an event or like a holiday or something. And like, you don't have to apply as many coats of mascara. So let's be real. Let's save the mascara. Do them a favor and just wear falsies. Okay, so the last product I got was not something that I went into the store thinking that I wanted to get or needed to get. But you know how they always get you with 
freaking small little bottles on the way out at the checkout line. So I am totally a sucker for that and I've been wanting to try this anyways. And same as the Pureology, I was like, well, I'll try a mini bottle before I try the big ones and splurge. So I got the Dry Bar Southern Bell Volume Boosting Mousse um, in just a little travel size. I think this was like $13, so like, <laughs> Let's be real, still kind of a splurge for this size, but um, I've just heard so many great things about Dry Bar's products, and I'm just really pumped to use this and see if it really does give me Southern Belle volume. All right, so for my next stop, I went into Sephora. They were conveniently located very close to each other at the outdoor shop, so uh, good for uh, me, but not good for me at the same time. Anyway, so I have been trying the Way Texturizing Spray um, in the travel size bottle, because like I told you, that's my trick to try it out before I splurge and buy the big one. And I bought it, I believe, in Singapore around Christmas time when I was still on the cruise ship and basically loved it. You know when you wash your hair and your hair is just like, limp and lifeless and just like will not do anything for day one when you have no dry shampoo in it. Yeah, well this product freaking makes your hair look incredible on the first day that you wash it. So this is the texturizing hairspray. I just like to um, spray this in my hair. I like pull my hair apart like that and it makes so much volume. Also just gives it a little bit of texture and grip and like grit to it I guess so that way um, you actually can look like you have style and not look like a um, drowned, flat-haired rat. Okay, and then the last product that I got at Sephora, thank God, finally got my last product I needed to get out of the store. So I got the Sheriff Medium Hold Hairspray, the Dry Bar one as well. This one um, is another like really highly recommended product. Um, this I just went for the full bottle on the first try, so we shall see. I've just, I, I don't know, I guess, oh, you know what? I couldn't find a little bottle. That's why I got the big bottle, but I mean, it's a hairspray, so like I'm gonna use the whole thing no matter what, even like if I don't love it, but I'm sure I probably will because everything that Sephora has, I love. All right, you guys, so that is it for my mini Ulta and Sephora haul that happened today. The weather was just so beautiful and I had to go out and do a work thing anyways and um, I just wanted to wear a cute sweater and look cute so, you know, I just happened to be near Ulta and Sephora so I went for it. So I hope you enjoyed the products. If you guys have used any of these products, um, let me know how they work. Um, I will come back probably on my Instagram stories to let you know how I'm liking them. Um, but if you have any questions or um, product recommendations for me, just drop them in the comments down below. As always, please subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this one. Um, give it a like and a thumbs up if you like this video and you wanna see more like it. I will link all like outfit details below, lip color and all of that if you are interested as well. So I hope to see you guys again and have a great day. Bye.